Hey guys, what's up? I'm doing another video about my iPad. I know, if you don't want to see, hear, listen to anything about an iPad ever again, just X out. <laughs> because, yeah, I thought I'd try, try what, I don't know. I thought I'd do like an updated what's on my iPad, I know already, but I did it like a week after I got it and I've got some more apps now and I'm sort of more swaying this to maybe school edition maybe I don't know anyway first thing I want to show you is the case and this came last week I don't know and it's one of these cases and it's got this strap thing here so it's like a book so it's got the strap and then my tongue really hurts is that weird and then it comes out like that so it's like a book like that and then it swivels let me see if I can try and show you so you can sit it like that obviously you have it like this which I'm going to do now I want to thank Jade from JD Elaine one um, and just who showed me or told me how to like move these across the page I've done it so I now put that one on the bottom page I more organized it a little bit better maybe so I've got like the social media ones, so Twitter, Facebook and Instagram at the top. And then next to that is BBC News. And then I've got iPlayer, ITB Player, 4OD and TuneIn Radio across on the second one down. This is all on the second page by the way. And then I've got all my train ones there. And then, I don't know, I've got more miscellaneous ones at the bottom. So I've got the Weather Channel. TV guide, the calculator, one to this, which I haven't actually used yet. Uh, draw free, which, and Solitaire, and I've got Pick Stitch, which I have done a few Instagram pictures with. And Photoshop Express, which is amazing. And on this page, apart from some other things on here, which I'm going to have to organise, it's more of a page which is more tailored to my uni stuff even though I'm not going to really use one. I don't know. I don't know. Anyway, so I've got one note at the top which I had originally on my last one. So I won't go too much into that if you want to see that. That's on my last iPad video, like what's in my iPad. And then I've got the dictionary, which is just a dictionary. I haven't actually opened it. You can search words and then you can find their definitions for them, which is just amazing, isn't it? Because I actually do have a dictionary, but this is just on here. And then I have Dragon Dictation, which I got this, I was watching uh, sort of what's on my iPad for your school edition where I got a lot of my ideas for what apps I'm going to, well, got a lot of ideas for apps. And that was from, what's her name, Clamorista16, I don't know, but uh, I got it from there. So what you do is you tap to dictate. Hi, my name's Matt. And then it comes up there. So it is actually quite a good thing because I was going to originally get a dictaphone for my birthday. But then, I don't know, I got sort of off the idea. I don't know what happened. They're really expensive. They're like, a hundred, well, the good quality ones are a hundred and something. But now I've got like this. I can sort of use it for lectures, but I don't know how much memory it will take up. Then I've also got Dropbox, which I saw... Again, I think her name's Caitlin, I don't know. Um, she had that, so I thought that would be a good idea, but I don't know how effective it will work because I don't have a MacBook, so I don't know if it works on PC, laptops or anything. And then I've got flashcards, which is just like a flashcard app, so you can make flashcards ready for exams and stuff. And then oh, I've also got documents, which again is just like notes, I think. So yeah. So that is basically it really for all the apps that I'm going to use for uni. If you've got any more apps, I know I'm going to say this again, but if you've got any more apps and you've got an iPad or an iPhone that you can recommend to get, not, I really want free ones, <laughs> I don't want to pay. <laughs> but um, yeah, and these, and if you've got any more specific ones that might help me with uni, but I think I've got everything I need. Like the main ones that I'm going to use are probably the documents ones and the dragon dictation ones which yeah maybe flashcards when it gets more to like um exam time but i don't know how much i'll use them and if you want to know about my case by the way it was um 
it was nine ninety nine on Amazon, so that is really good. And considering when you, you can buy like the same one in Argos, well basically the same one, I don't mean I don't know what brand it is or whatever, but that was like forty four ninety nine, so that's a huge saving and it also locks the screen when you close it. So yeah, hope you guys are all well. Um thanks for watching and I'll see you in my next video. Bye!